The second semifinal of this year's Champions League goes down this Wednesday, May 1st at 3 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time between Borussia Dortmund and Paris Saint-Germain. Now let's look at how these teams got here. If we recap last round, Dortmund fell 2-1 in Spain to Atletico Madrid in leg one in the quarterfinals, but they responded in a big way with a 4-2 win back in Germany in leg two to move on. Meanwhile, PSG fell behind as well in leg one, losing at home 3-2 to Barcelona. In leg two, they fell behind again, 1-0 early. Looked like they could be on their way out, but a Barcelona red card in the 29th minute helped them to score the game's next four goals. They went on to win 4-1 to one to reach the semis here. Now let's get into the best Dortmund and PSG predictions, odds, and form between these teams. Be sure to give the video a like and subscribe to the channel to get more soccer picks. We're closing in on 2,000 subs very soon. So let's get into the odds here. Dortmund will be plus 175, the draw plus 260, PSG plus 145. Dortmund to advance, 2-1 to one odds. PSG, very much favored to go through over the two legs at minus 275. The over 2.5, minus 188. Certainly looks like there could be goals in this game. The under, 2.5 plus 150. Both teams to score yes, minus 225. And the both teams to score no, plus 162. If we look at the odds over at bet 365, head-to-head. -head. These teams actually met in the group stage, so there's lots to compare recently. These teams, they just played. PSG winning 2 nothing in Paris in September, and they drew 1-1 in Germany back in December. Otherwise, they also played in the 2020 Champions League. Both teams winning at home, Dortmund 2-1 and PSG 2-0. Prior to that, though, the next closest games were way back in the 2010 Europa League. For Dortmund, a spot in the top four in Germany may now be out of reach, and maybe they were looking ahead uh, this weekend as they lost 4-1 to away to Leipzig. And they also lost Mats Hummels to an injury, so that will be worth monitoring for this game. They are now winless in two, having drawn Leverkusen as well a week before. They have just two wins in their last four games, but they are 7-1-3 and three in their past 11, so just three losses in 11 games. Both teams to score bets have gone a perfect 5-0 and of late. There's been at least two or more goals in 14 of their 15 games. Dortmund have scored themselves in 14 of 15, as well as in 20 of their last 23. In the Champions League only, Dortmund has scored in eight straight games. Both teams to score bets have gone 5-1 and one of late. There hasn't been a home Champions League game. They haven't lost a home Champions League game, Dortmund, in 10 games. And they actually only have two home Champions League losses in their last 21, going way back across multiple seasons. For PSG, they had a rather meaningless game, playing 15th place Le Havre on Sunday. They were down 2-1 at half. They did go on to draw 3-3. They did need a late 95th minute goal to do so. They didn't really need the win as they had the League One title basically wrapped up. They were later crowned League One champs anyways, with Monaco losing to Lyon. Like they likely were also looking ahead to this game, knowing they would likely get that title one way or another. Now, PSG only has two losses in their last 32 games. After that Le Havre game, they've now scored in 12 straight. And they've also scored a goal in 38 of 39. It's very rare to not see PSG getting on the scoreboard. Granted, they're playing a lot of weaker opponents in the French League, but both teams to score is still 6-0 in their last six games. In the Champions League, they've scored in all 10 games, but they've conceded in seven, and both teams to score has gone seven and three. Both teams to score in over 2.5 is an even five and five, but has hit in each of their past three games. For Dortmund and PSG prediction and best bet, Dortmund just keeps upsetting the odds to get this far. Certainly no one would have expected them to be in the final four, but here they are, so you can't count them out at this stage. They have already did, though, fail to beat PSG in both group stage matches. Now, both teams didn't need to necessarily win this weekend, and, and neither did. Dortmund have been in great form at home, like we've said, very rarely losing at home in the Champions League. Both teams have also been scoring, though, and conceding, as lots of both teams to score bets have been hitting. But at minus 225, you simply can't just bet both teams to score in this game. Both teams to score in over 2.5 could definitely be an option at minus 138. But maybe we see a goal from both teams here and a tighter match. We are getting down to the final four here. Now, only two of 10 Dortmund Champions League games have seen over three goals. The under 2.5 has also gone seven and three in those games. For PSG, under 2.5 is just four and six. So they have seen some games going over two and a half goals, but only three of 10 have seen three or more. In this the group stage, there was just four combined goals between them in their two games that they met up. So let's look at a couple same game parlay options between both teams to score and totals bets here. You could go both teams to score and under four at plus 225 if you want to get some really good odds there. You could also go both teams to score plus under five total goals in the game. So that covers you in all kinds of ways. As long as both teams get on the scoreboard, you could still get a third or fourth goal. You could just see a 1-1 and you could still cash at plus 105 odds if you create 
a same game parlay over at Bet365. Let's make that the best bet. Do you see a winner in this game? High scoring, low scoring? Make your picks down there in the comments and good luck this week.